That's still a lot, damn. Yeah, I only pay like 600 for my house every year. It's like 500 plus 100 for the other lot. It's like a small yard. I got it pretty easy on rent, but my electricity costs and my water costs are, um, well, kind of makes up for the difference. Let's put it that way. I mean... Uh... Okay. I want to just continue with this, or... Okay. Um... Uh... <laughs> this is pretty fucked up, I gotta say, for a level. Hey, Hesu. Big fan, is that what you meant earlier? Hello, Chippendale. That's a great show, by the way, plus game. I used to play the NES game. Chippendale was a lot of fun. There is no universe I actually saved that. What the fuck? Oh. That's scary. It's an interesting idea, though. I gotta give him props for that. Quack shot for Sega Genesis? No, I never. I don't think I've even known that one for Sega Genesis. I own many little games for the Sega Genesis. This is mostly Sonic related games that I can remember, anyways. You know what? I like humor. I'm glad they give us three one us at the end still. Isn't that like poison shrooms anyway, so it wouldn't matter, so I don't know. Oh, Supernova has the wall breaker, nice. You got this level in expert, you need my help to beat it. If you got enough channel points, you can submit a level and I'll take a look at it. You meant what you said earlier. I don't even know what that means, though. The thing you said in Blank's chat. <laughs> I don't know what that means in context. Your computer's already broken down, so you're just kind of like on your phone or something, then? I own very little games for Sega Genesis. I do have a Genesis somewhere in this house. I gotta go find it, though. I was supposed to hit the P-switch so I can hit the... Hmm. Is this an actual Auto Mario? I'm almost said to play it out. Like, this is a Super Expert, it's Auto? What the fuck? That's... I don't believe it. It's such a hard thing to believe, an Auto Mario and, and Super Expert without a twist? Yeah, right. Yeah, ain't no way. I, I know, that's why I skipped. There's just no way, I don't believe it. The mega hard level, this is the mushroom coins. Okay. Uh. 
Uh huh. There's a fire flowering coins. This is this a troll level? Hold on, let's just do it this way. Oh, there is a power up up here. Hmm. Sure, we'll go in a pipe and see if we die and skip. Okay. What? Oh god, I'm dead. Um, yeah, okay. Uh... Wow, that's a lot to take in. I don't think we need to get to do all of this, though, I'd imagine. Oh, that's for a mushroom, I see. I understand now. You have to work hard for your mushroom, basically. That's really awesome. Please, I just want some coins. Oh yeah, there's a boo ghost over here. I have to throw it out of the way. I think we're good. I guess I'll check the other bosses and see how bad they are. I don't believe this level for a second. There's no way you need all of these. Right? There's just no way. It's the same boss fight again! What? It's just slower. Yeah, I don't know. Invisible keys somewhere. I don't believe you. Grinded this out? No way. I'm gonna assume it's probably a troll. No? Wow, okay. That's a skill level. Okay, that's what goes down and then fights you there. That's for all that for a key. I don't know, I don't know if it's worth it. I just gotta pay attention to the saw blade section. I have to go backwards though, and you only get top? Yeah, it's not worth the lives. Hey, JB. Can you enter a door when you hit a pal like that? Yeah. Hmm. I've never seen that before. I understand entering a door getting the key on the same frame, but... Oh, I have to move the muncher away. I see the issue. Roll. Probably. Give me one second here. Wait. I mean, I got this the other day. I guess we give it one try.
Still uncleared, by the way, <laughs> which is not a good sign. Yeah, that's what I thought. Bit blind there. It's also free. Damn, I should have played that level then. I just didn't trust it. I mean, what's the speed required for this? Oh, we have to press left at some point. Never mind. Was not ready. Apparently, I'm going to be in the quota 10 events. So that's cool. If this was all coins, I would have been fine. Well. Wow. Oh. Don't go back the other way, please. Thank you. Wait, why are you letting me get out of the map? <laughs> I don't I don't think so, buddy. Oh shit, okay. It gave me enough time to kind of react to it. Yeah, alright. It seems like I'm in the Quid 10 event, so I gotta start practicing. I should ask what version. If it's V50, I'm solid. If it's not, I'll have to practice a different version. Just listening to my stream and replies and Discord DMs. It's all versions? Wait, 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 wait. Did we get a pick which version? I don't like that. I feel like we should all be on the same playing field. Unless you mean like it's different versions per round, which is fine. But there's like big differences in each version. V40 is definitely the best version in terms of getting a score. That's what scares me. That's such a lame, uh, you know, wait, what? Oh. I didn't think you would do that. That was so risky. I thought I just died there. Went a little too fast. I'm gonna hit it. Who, who needs a who needs a power up? Not me. Mm -mm. I'm good. It's probably a progressive too. Damn it! It's a boss fight. I should have known better. Oh, this is an asteroid level. What the fuck?
Oh my god, dude. Go away, Bowser! Wait, I can get one-ups here. Um, Oh, how, though? They're, everything's gonna be picked up. I don't think I can get one-ups. I can't. Damn. Well, I guess I'll take the single one-up and leave. Was it fake or was it real, Seamus? That's all I need to know. The mini boss level. Hey, Casey. Go get, you know, back into unpacking. <laughs> I saw that you were leaving Blank's uh, stream to go unpack, so. Quit procrastinating. Quit proc ah, I can't even speak. Quit procrastinating. Jesus Christ, I can't, I can't even say any words today. Goddamn. I get, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't have said it a single word, and now I'm just paying my dues. What the fuck is that jump? Hear me out? <laughs> I, I know exactly what the issue is, and I get it. I'm not saying it's bad. Because I do it too. So I get it. But you did say you were gonna go unpack, to be fair. Oh, what the fuck is this? Interesting level. Give me three one-ups. The pow I have to hit. Terrible. Can I go back or no? Yeah. But you get the flower, then you have to go to red pipe one, two, that starts again. So there is, it is fake. I knew it. I was like, there's no way this person has that skill level. I disagree. You know? I just, whenever I see a bullshit level, I call it out. I'm like, there's no way this person had the skill level to do this. Okay, I could probably do that. I gotta be careful. Yeah, I'm not eight today, so then you... <laughs> that sounds like quitter talk to me, Casey. That's really hard. Am I gonna get three ones for this? Because I feel like I'm working hard for nothing. Yeah, I know, Bully. I saw. We were talking to... I was talking to Sheriff in DMs. I can't make that, dude. That is such a hard jump. Wait! Maybe I touch the wall first instead of holding backwards. Hold on. Maybe I'm making this harder than it needs to be. Oh my god, I'm making it harder than it needs to be. That one is taller than it needs to be, you see that? Bro, where's all the coins and one-ups? Nothing? No. You'll see how fast that is? Nah, I'm good on that. 
Really? If it was like infinite back and forth, back and forth, I could time it. But after no, I'm no, I'm good on that. If it gave it like multiple like brick blocks, maybe. But one chance. Don't grab a key, I assume. Don't grab a fire flower, I assume. Don't grab anything. Oh, it's just a. But how do I? I mean, okay. If this is sub world, then yes, I get why you're not supposed to have any of that. But how am I supposed to avoid these flowers? Can't. Maybe you have to have fire flower. That's what it's telling me. Okay, so if there's a sub world, I'm leaving immediately. All right, buddy. That's just bullshit now at this point. What? 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 Why does that one have a key in it? All right, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm not falling down in a pit I can't see. I'm good. Just a normal day in Super Expert, you know? Okay, you're supposed to probably do something there. Oh, I just lost. What if, what if the key door is required to win? And then you go back and yeah, and then you win the key door, I see. Um, see, man, send me the copy of the mini boss level in viewer. I'm gonna go take a look at it. Um, okay. Oh, that's cool. Uh huh. How do I get out? How do I get out? Alright, anyways. Some sort of a glitch, probably. Oh, there it is? Okay. Owl block. Okay, we're gonna play this level first, and then we'll go play the mini boss level. So am I supposed to... Oh, I just have to time my jump. Oh, well, I mean, if you're gonna just offer me some coins, I'll take it. Also, if I throw this pad right now, I lose. I could farm one ups here. Nothing says I can't. Also, there's a big little L over there, which is concerning, but you know. All right, looking at this thing in the viewer, the uh, level that I skipped earlier. Where's this Dev Star? Oh, there's a there's a cape over there. Um. just fly for the Death Star? Ah, Spike Bend, I see it. Okay, cool. Alright, that's good to know. Oh, I see. You're supposed to do this. Lower this down. And 
I, I guess we're just es escorting that. Which is really easy if I just throw all the POWs and just get a new one, but whatever. Pretty cool level, though, nonetheless. I mean, it's simple, which is really nice. supposed to really do here, but I'm just gonna take the checkpoint now and move on. It's a cool puzzle level too. Oh, now we're playing the really hard mode. Here we go. Uh, am I supposed to kill this? Super expert. It's too simple. But it's also kind of cute. Oh, here we go. Super expert right here. Am I making a bridge or something? Is that what they're giving me these for? Oh, I, I see. I get it. That's why it's in Super... I figured out why it's in Super Expert. Not many people know about this. They have no indicator for you either. I think they do it twice. Yikes. Yeah, if you didn't know about that head bump tech, you would have not cleared the level at all. There's no indicator for that, which is really sad, but the level was kind of fun, so... Sure. I think today we'll do probably Quota 10 v15, and then I'll look into the schedule of the Quota 10 league, and I'll change versions and strats accordingly. I'm kind of excited now because if there's like different things that we're doing other than the standard Quota 10, I'm kind of happy. I think you can make that without uh, worrying about the pal. In fact, I'm gonna put a shaman on. Wait, did I didn't. Oh my god. Wait, did... oh, the mantra had a key! Well, at least I, didn't... I can skip. I would have been fine had I just killed the muncher. I was worried about that too. I'm like, does it have a key? Because if it does, I can't choose it. Easy challenge. Uh huh. Right, so I had to time that shit. That's really cool. <laughs> what, wait, what, what? What the heck is going on? Ah. 
Wait, I, I'm dead. I'm gonna go back. What? Oh, that's just a reset door? Wait, what? It's not a reset door? Uh, where the hell do I go? In the pipe? Back at the start? Back at the start. No fucking shot you make me go back there. Uh, dead. Do I want to continue? Not really. I need lives. I mean, I'm sure it's probably free at that point, but there was no way to make one-ups. Except to the two launchers I gave out 60 coins total. And even then you're wasting time in this, you know... In a speed run of all things. Let me guess it's fake. It's not fake. Let me guess I die if I go in here with the power up. What? Okay. So you actually needed the thing? And that was a hidden power-up, too. Oh, hello, Bowser. That's probably required. Yep. This is a damageless level. Wow. No clear condition, but hey, I'll take a plus two, thanks. Hmm, that's a very interesting looking door, I'm just saying. I'm gonna check more info on this and then play the other level we were playing earlier. I almost would boot for the hidden fire flower and the damage list, no clear condition. But like, if you take damage, you're gonna skip anyway, so like it's not the biggest of deals. It's not like there's a pit or something, so. But if that door is somehow real in the, in the I don't know, maybe in the Bowser section, then you're getting a boo. It, it's just an aesthetic door. Okay, that's fine. And yeah, the hidden flower part of it wasn't even that bad. Like, you knew there was something there because they left an opening. But, doesn't excuse the fact that she's just given us, you know, an indicator of some kind for that. Because you need it to even progress. And you get locked out with the, with the pipe. So, like, what do you even do about that? Oh, this guy. They, they they think they made a really hard level, but in reality, they, uh... Oh, wow, I see the... Wait. There's So there's two dev stars. Interesting. Do I even need the spike mint at all? Could I just, like, use the earlier power-ups just to... Huh. Wait, where's the Kidor area? I just... Oh, it's up there. Oh, and it's hidden, too. That's great. I guess I can use the first... I'll just try to get a key. So I'll get a key with the Fire Flower, and then I'll use a Mushroom to get the Dev Star, right? And then I'll use the other... Yeah, okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use... We'll do the, we'll do the Dev Star first. How many do I have to go? Very many for this one stupid Mushroom. That's cool. All right, so this will give us a dev star. Now uh, getting out is gonna be the hard part. There we go. I don't think I have enough time to get the other stuff, so I'm not gonna bother. I'm gonna get the fire flower. I'm gonna try to do one of the rooms with the fire flower. Probably the easier room, just to make it nice and easy for me, you know? God. 
please. When I'm in Super Expert, I play so much better. What is going on? Do you want the Fire Flower or not? God dang. Apparently you don't want it. There we go. Okay, so now we can do an easy room and then we'll go back into the red room, I guess. Take a star with us, perhaps? We'll see how it works. Hold on. Simply Casey Page cheered with 127 bits. Okay. Happy um, Morrow Day. This is I'm not dying. fake There's news. No way. There's no way. Uh, Casey, they get 127 bits. Do I even... I don't even want to do this. I guess I could use the cape, but... Nah, let's just get the mushroom. I have ideas. We just gotta get the first Death Star. Actually, we could fight Morton legit. I don't think it's worth it, though. Because you get the, the, the star in here anyway, so, like, what's the point? If I could just get out fast enough, you know, I can go and get a free kill. But there's no way I have enough time here. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. We'll get our Fire Flower next. And we'll try to do this one legit. There we go. There we go. That's two keys. Um, I guess we get the star, and then we go for the cave instead, I think, at the end. Yeah, we get a star, and then we'll try to go and pipe, uh, yellow. Oh my god, please. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna get it now, it's too late. Damn, okay. That's fine. It's so annoying. Uh, I guess we go get a mushroom over here. I'm assuming this is where it's at. Okay. It's kind of marked, I guess. I'll give you that. Um, wait, you only can go in here once. Why did they give out hidden mushrooms for each key door then? I don't understand. Oh, the, the boot cable. I don't care. I, I guess I could fly up there. Is that what they want me to do? Something's fishy about that. If I can just get two keys with one star, we're good. Okay, that should be enough time, maybe, if we're lucky. Okay, we got it. Two keys. Two keys. Now, we get the fire flower, and we go and get one more. With it. And then we go get the cave, I think. Wait, I already got this one. I need to go... I'll go in green. Maybe it's easier to fight the harder bosses with the power up. jump. Okay, that's three. So, to get the cape, we have to go through the long snake block of doom. 
And there's like, oh my god, there's a bunch of hidden blocks and you only get one chance. I need to take damage. There's another star, right? Maybe we just take the star route and try to go in the blue pipe. Okay, that might be enough time to get the, the thing. No! I was jumping too high! I had it! I could just won instantly! God, I hate this level already. It's terrible. Because you have to get the two kill, the star. And I had it too, I was gonna just leave. I mean, I, I can't do anything if he just avoids me. So I need to get that kill. I, I guess I could get him on the other way around, but this is easier at the start. Let me just double check. If I go in that key door, do I just win? Stop double clicking it. Well, it doesn't lie. You do have to make a big jump over it. So yeah, you do just instantly win. Okay. Yeah, I saw it, don't worry. They even marked the spikes behind the goal, which is really weird. Oh my god, that's so good. I'm gonna go in the blue one since I got enough time. All right, we get the fire flower and then we go into, I think. But there's a couple of powers we can get, like, right? So I think we try to get at least one key without losing the double power up. And then we have to go in there and get the star at the end. It's not a big deal. So we go into yellow mode, no, green mode, because it's easier. Please jump. Oh my god, please. You're gonna get me killed for this garbage. I'm dead. There's a reason why they have two dev stars. <laughs> this level is just garbage. Deduced without the extra freebies. It's awful, dude. Um, I hit up and it didn't go in. I got two wheel spins now to do. Just let me in. Oh my god. I'm holding up and nothing is happening. I'm going this way. Uh, that was a bad idea. <laughs> you don't need both of them in one go. There's no way, dude. 
If I'm gonna beat this level, I need to have both dev stars to at least kill one of the, my enemies for me. Guess I'm going this way. Oh, hi! How's it going? I guess I, I start over now. <laughs> All this just to get one fucking mushroom every single time at the beginning. God dang, I hate this already. It's so boring. For garbage, it's really boring. <laughs> I hate whale. Uh, you, you got me with the wrong dude. I play Mario Maker. I don't know who this uh, Q10 guy is. I've never heard of such a thing before in my life. Well, I mean, I'm not. It's I'm not in the run, so it doesn't really matter to be honest. I had to jump there. Can I play Donkey Kong? You're in the wrong universe, my guy. <laughs> the one time Donkey Kong Country went Donkey Kong Country 3, you think I'm a Donkey Kong guy? Damn. Well, I mean, it's unclear. It's the only reason why I'm even touching this. No other reason. I don't know if I have enough time to get the blue one. I'll try. Nope. Oh my god, please. Can I get the yellow one at least? Nope. Okay, that's enough for blue, for sure. If you did this legit, you would have a harder time-ish. This is just a terrible level. Okay. Alright, now we can get the fire fire. We're in part two. We're in phase two. Now. Can we beat this without taking more than one point of damage? Let's see. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, we made it. Now, we gotta get this stupid uh, thing I haven't gotten yet, since we now we took a power-up damage. We need to go, actually... You know, I have an idea. We can get a mushroom. We didn't go into yellow yet, I'm pretty sure. We're gonna open this up and then we're gonna get the cape and we're gonna fly back and then win. That's the plan now. Yeah. So if you go in here, you get a power up. I don't think it's progressive. Let me just double check before I open that. I don't think they are. No, they're just mushrooms. We go back in here now. Go back here, and then go back in the red, and hope the guy we can go into yellow one, and then we have to get the cape to win. Oh my god, we got it. Okay, go into yellow one and get out safely. That is not safely. Dude, that boom boom... <laughs> In the on-offs, I swear to god, dude. I had it. I actually had it, too. It's so sad. 
I feel like this is like an eight hour grind for the creator. That's how bad this level is. Let's go this way. Oh my god. If you can. Oh, nope. I guess going left is probably the better idea if you need to get the kill on uh, Boom. Oh, not Boom. I'm on uh, Morton. Sure. Whatever works, I guess. I don't think it's a skill issue when it's really just random bullshit, but sure. There's no control, that's not skill issue. Um, green. We'll fight the green one. The other one's too hard. Fine, we'll take one damage point. Oh my god. Okay, just... If it loses, that's fine. Like, I'm just so used to it at this point. Oh my god, dude. <sighs> that's exactly what skill issue stands for. No, I don't think you understand what skill issue is. Skill issue is when it's in your control, and you make a skill issue out of it. None of that shit is in your control. Unless you want to pause buffer. Reaction speed's a real thing, by the way. It's like player vision that people don't seem to comprehend for whatever stupid reason. I mean, eventually I'm going to be able to make this so con like consistent as long as Morton is not rng in the wrong way possible. Trying to fight this legit, which is gonna be hard as balls, but yeah. Sure. Holy shit! And now we can try to get the power up here. Gotta get out. Go and yell and get out. Okay, we have plenty of extra time to get out without even getting the cape now. Wow, we don't even need the cape and spike bit in this dumb level with all their dev shit. Although I shouldn't say too much yet because I can still die. Wait. Okay, we win. As far as I know, we get this mushroom. And then we can just jump over at the end. Didn't need their stupid dev cape, didn't need their stupid dev spike mint next to the cape. There we go. I wonder what the clear check time was. All right. That's understandable when you had to get the cape and the spike vent. see the clear condition. <laughs> I'm so used to just not seeing it in my mind. I actually could have won that if I would just landed on the um the shell there instead of playing it safe. I well I would have one shotted it. Damn, that sucks.
I've been taught to just ignore all clear conditions in, in the beginning. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wow. Oh, there was plenty of land down there, apparently. Yeah, all right. Um, but you don't... I don't... Un what? Yeah, hold on. You know, just in case. All right. I had to make sure you didn't have a key. Um, bunch of random blind BS is what this is. Seems doable, but it's blind, so. Kind of hard to play it. There was just, okay, they don't know how to, they literally have no idea how to twirl. That is good information. Oh, I, I love missing my jump. I don't understand with the spike on the floor in that section that it's in. There's no bomb. What? You're just not supposed to jump there, apparently? I'm just confused. They know how to do that wall jump, though, so that's even more confusing. Requirement, but they've shown they don't know how to twirl, so never mind, they know. Uh, yeah, they know how to twirl, but they just choose not to use it, apparently. You have to twirl there. No one-ups? Man. <sighs> So part of the level you have to twirl, part of the level you don't have to twirl, which is really bad. I think I'm actually gonna boo it for that. It's just super blind, the whole level. Might have changed my mind if they gave me one of so. To make up for the loss of life on that. Guy's name is Megatroll, so it's probably a skip. to get past that without falling down, which is probably what they want me to do. No left. Yeah, I'm number three right now. 
Remember, no left. Um... They all look the same to me. Maybe it's the vine in the back of it. Maybe behind the piranha, I feel like. It's not. I don't I don't see a difference. I see stuff behind the snow key, but there's nothing that's different there. Is there seriously one pixel somewhere? I feel like behind the prana has to be the answer. But I don't see a difference in the vine. So, I'm checking the corners, right? And I see something. I don't. What is. What is this? What block is that? In the top left there. What it. That has to be the answer. Oh my god. It's an arrow? Okay, well, can I, I can go left now all of a sudden? Yeah, I need more speed there, it's ice. It really was a one pixel difference, basically. anti-mushroom mechanic? Okay. Anyways. Are you kidding me? This wasn't even not even marked. This is bullshit at this point. Yeah, you're not you're not worth it. No, the play. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Like, it wasn't gonna give me one ups anyways. To be fair, just garbage. I don't. Press this tag, by the way, but I'll try. Never mind, I die. This is like tech you have to learn and without dying to it. There's an auto setup for it, but that level didn't have the auto setup. Oh, this is just a run killer. A normal level, finally. Maybe. Not jumping kids, just hitting blocks. Oh, I see. This is actually kind of a cool idea. 
I like how he just ended up killing himself. Um, I'll be able to get a mushroom here. Oh, let's go. Get cheesed. Oh. Well, I didn't need the cannonball anyways. Bro, <laughs> you can't just throw that shit at me when I have mushroom. I know, I know I'm not supposed to have the mushroom, but that's still bullshit. I would have died without the mushroom anyways. Let me know when you're done, by the way, Crater. You're really done being a piece of shit. Cool. No, that wasn't anti-cheese, that was just bullshit. Even if you didn't have a mushroom, regardless, it w the section was not designed for mushroom regardless, so like it didn't matter to the Crater that you had a mushroom there, so it's not anti-cheese. It's just, it, they throw it, you know? They throw it in there out of nowhere and they just kill the player for it, so. I think something's supposed to be in the fire thingy right now. But it doesn't matter? Because I just did it too quickly? Huh. I think remove the falling blocks section and give the player more power-ups because th those boss fights are kind of like if they were actually working they would be really hard looks like a job for you uh Does it actually work, M check? Or do you want me just to see how well it's designed for getting points? Is that what you're saying? Ah, um. I mean, the level says troll, I guess. I get it. I'm just gonna, just gotta skip, right? You know? What? There's a spikement hidden somewhere. Or one of the spinies was a spikement? Because there's no way you win the level otherwise. I mean, if you want to send it in, go for it. I still got to do like two wheel spins here in a moment when I get a chance. Once we're done with the set, I'll just do wheel spins and then we'll do, um, we can do any levels that were redeemed. And then we'll move on to Lethal Company. We'll do some quota 10 practice. Maybe I can take a look and see. I already know this tech, but I don't want to do it. I, I can take a look and see what the first one is. Maybe. It's in the PDF, so I have to download it first. To the front! Hmm, I see. Oh, they have di many different versions. They have V40, V45. Um, I don't know what V45BH and V45AH is. Before something, after something? Uh, V47, V48. Wait, why, why are we doing V48, V49, V50, V50? Uh, V47 and V49 are basically the same thing, minus the, like, the bug fixes, right? So wouldn't V49 be the better one to run instead of V47? Uh, uh, let's see. What's the first week? I'm kind of curious. Uh... Wow, there's a lot of rules in here. Oh, they don't really say? 
what the first one is? I'll have to look into it. Maybe I'll have to talk to Sheriff about it. I would like to know what version we're starting with. I want to assume it's V50 because everyone's so used to it, but who knows. This seems like a really long level I just spawned into. Oh boy. Can't make that jump. I could probably shell jump. Am I even supposed to be up here? I guess the Z jump would have worked there, huh? It's all right. Yeah. How do I get up there, though? They're hidden stuff. There was platforming up there. I don't like this. Another mushroom. Well, we can finally get rid of this shell here. Ah, so I need to on off. I need a trigger. Cool. Maybe we can just up throw this one. Mhm. Mm That's cool, but like, how do I get the other ones? Okay, I know where at least where one of them is at. <laughs> I just don't know how to get to them. Where's this on off that I need to trigger? That's a bigger question. Okay, wait, there's one right there. That's the on off. Okay, so that's one of them. That means the other one has to be over here. I guess I could up throw this, right? Oh, and then we up throw. Ah, we need to up throw, I see. Need the thing? Yes, I do. That's gonna be so hard to do. It's gonna be like a big jump, basically. I just win now, right? Because that's just the whole level, right? Not really a bad level for getting coins. You kind of see what you need to do, and there's plenty of extra enemies on the floor. If you kill all of them, it's kind of your fault. What? Wait, you wait. Hold on. What, what was the actual intention of getting the on-off coin then? Because you can just up throw to get that one. You, you hold on. You were meant to spring. Nah, I refuse to believe that one. There's no way. You just get used to the momentum uh, shifting left and right, M check, and then you just get really good at it. That's how it takes. Yeah, I don't know. Um, you get five minutes to get all of these coins, and you, you can go back as far as I know to get them all. There's nothing like super hidden. It's all on screen. Sure. It's a small level, it's not like fully extended either, so they actually just didn't bother to stretch the whole thing and try to make something out of it, because a lot of a lot of critters do that and they make really garbage levels out of it. But when you don't stretch it all the way, you can make some really good stuff. I'm not supposed to hit the P-switch. I'm dead now, right? Yep. Um, if I touch it, I'm gonna have to just step on a P-switch and skip. I 
I shouldn't even be able to skip here, by the way, but here we are. We can do this one out of Endless, probably. We got time. We gotta get seven more clears anyways for a full set. Or at least to finish 15 clears. We've only done eight clears today in an hour, yikes. That seems really unfair. I might have to do like a thing here. Maybe I'll just do it like this. Yeah, that works. Naked pipe, nice. In theory, you could time the P switch and then go grab one and then get out of the level, but. Oh! We do have the opportunity of doing that, but I don't think it's worth it. That's it, right? <laughs> Take your boo. They could at least give me a checkpoint at the end there. You think there'll be one at the bottom? Hmm. Hmm. Cool, I really like figuring out what the fuck I need to do here. Wish I would've put this in the viewer before playing it now. We found information. We'll get it on the next go for sure then. We can just go over at the top. No way you just got the best weapons in the game, Diz. No fucking shot. Dude. That's actually pretty awesome. I'm over here stuck with the plume and set shadow scythe. <laughs> Which they're not bad weapons, don't get me wrong. It's just I want the shadow blades. Did you uh, do the survey? I sent you in DMs and get an extra million gold and such. Who's your first guarantee? God damn, you're so lucky. What? Why do we even need this? What? Huh? Uh, I might get them. We'll see. I have the moon blades, the grimoire, the ice grimoire, and I have the huntsman rifle, the shotgun pistol. I want those three at least to have them on hand. The Night Killer is super good, by the way, for an SR. Very good. Alright, so we got seven more clears, and then we'll do the two spins plus M checks level. Yeah, the cape is so good. Yeah, I, I'm just putting on stuff that, you know, I don't have yet, so I can at least acquire them. This is tempting, but at the same time, I want to make lives. Yeah, the million gold is so nice. I already used up most of it for the weapon enhancement thing. By the way, you should try to get that red ticket in the weapon growth turn tournament or whatever. No, uh, sorry, weapon growth in general event. If I get locked behind here, I swear. I'm gonna do it. Okay. Because you need four of those we uh, advanced rep uh, weapon tickets to make an SSR. Do I want that? Hmm. 
I'm just gonna skip. I don't trust this for a second. Oh yeah, uh, Cha's weapon should be from the event if you have enough. You should have enough time to do one full go, go around if you just keep pulling copies of Cha for the dice rolls. You should only use the SSR um, weapon uh, crafting tickets on stuff like uh, Saw or Emma or something. I can do this, I just don't want to waste a life. Oh, you need 100. You click on the thing on the event thing, uh, the event item, and it tells you you need 100. Expert my ass, and super expert. And then when you have 100, you go into the crafting menu, and then you go to the middle tab, and you can make it there. Oh wait, you also get the weapon for free, um, if you do like five loops. It's on the left side of the screen in the event tab. It's actually 25 loops because it's four when you go around after a certain amount of time. But you should get the weapon guaranteed no matter what. You should be able to get it within the event. I believe in Con Concha can get it too in time limit. You have like a few days. It's not a big deal. Huh? Uh-oh. Oh, okay. So you just have to know that's there, apparently. I could probably do this. It's only 30 seconds long, right? Yeah, you should be able to get a weapon for free from the, uh, the event. Plus, you should be able to- you might be able to craft one in time. You might, you might be able to get two copies of it, but yeah, use the- Use four of those red tickets for sure on not Cha's weapon because you want to get like different weapons. Saw's weapon is the best weapon in the game. He gives her 140% critical damage uh, if you get all like all copies, and the first copy is really good. Um, okay. That is super risky. Yeah, that is super risky for one-ups. Um, it might not even be doable to get one-ups here, but I can definitely get the clear now. I'll just get the clear and move on. Can't even get the, like a one up sad lane. That's so sad. Yeah, you can't even get the one up. Very lame. Moving on. Yeah, when you slow everything down, the blades are super good, yeah. Try not to go past level 60 on your weapon, by the way. It gets super expensive at, after that point. But level 60 is a sweet spot for SSRs. And like level 40-ish for SRs, but you can get them to level 62 if you have enough money. Enough gold materials. Yeah, so that's why you gotta do the blue gates, because they give you all those materials that you need. Why did I fall for that? That's the easiest trick in the book. Not even paying attention. I mean, to be fair, it did look like it was open level. Little oh, did I know. Dev's on you? Nah. I wasn't looking at chat when I jumped. It's on me, actually. 
It's on me for not realizing this could have been a troll. It's all in, like, Japanese or something, so there's no way for me to know if it's a troll or not unless I just test and look around. Oh my god, you little bitch. You would put that there. And the spin jump off of you? Bruh. The one way is kind of suspicious. Alright. I thought for sure I was going to get hit by those springs. I do gotta say that though, Dis, the three star advanced on West Wind, the sniper rifle, is so broken that it outbeats the, uh, the, the Moonblade's damage and the Shadow Scythe's damage. Basically, I can do an additional 1.5 times, well, 2.5 times damage. I'm not doing the puzzle right now. I'm good. If you get... Okay, so the first... The first uh, advancement is already, like, a good sweet spot for the weapon, as long as you can charge it all the way away from enemies. But if you get the third advancement... This is a definitely a troll. If you get the third advancement, you get 50% damage... No, 30% damage bonus per stack, as long as you don't miss every 30 seconds. Plus 150% damage. Just off the bat. I was doing it in Power Destruction, and it beat my Shadow Scythe some damage. I was like, no fucking way. It beat that. Come on. Five seconds. What the hell is this? How? Okay, so I'm guessing the, the bloopers did not spawn. Because I off screen them. I can show the cyber rifle later thing today when I do a power of destruction if you want to see it. Assuming it's not wind resistant today. It's on me. I'm not even playing this. Let's just get out of here. I boot it because of the blooper section. Just a bunch of random parachute enemies at the end. Oh, there's, I'm sure there's something worse at the end, too. No indication No indication to throw the shell, either. Nobody likes this trick. Remove it from the game, please. God, I hate that trick. I can do it. I just don't like it. And it's actually harder than a regular slip shell jump, too, by the way. It's, it's a lot tighter. Like regular slip shell jumps aren't bad. They they kind they kind of blow to be honest, but at least they're not as bad as the oh god. At least they're not as bad as the uh, the smaller slip shell jumps that just yeah. You know, for an Atticus level, this is very tame. too tame. Is there a bonus over here? The hell is this? 
I know Atticus wouldn't put bullshit in their level, but I'm curious to see what this is. Should've grabbed the checkpoint first. Oh! Wow! Actually kinda nice. You don't know you'd be around later? That's fine. It'll be after uh, reset time at 5 p.m. PS2. Yeah, try to get as many copies of Cha if you can. She might even come back into the standard at all. We don't know. Uh, Choi came into the standard banner, but he's not very powerful right now. Cha might be like a limited character that will never come back unless it's like only on, uh, you know, on banner. I'm half tempted to grab that, but I shouldn't. Oh, I this red. Wait, I'm not soft locked, right? You'll you'll you're gonna see me, right? Atticus. Yeah, don't wonder why this isn't super expert. I swear to God, dude, I have to do the whole. I, I would rather play the whole level than wait for that shit. Wait, Atticus levels have dev skips in them, bruh. That's so sad because they actually make decent levels. I think there's like a spike thing up there. I'm kind of curious. But it probably won't do anything. Okay, because you still need to pick up something. Then. I'm always at Raphael Lives. What? What do you mean? Nothing's changed. The only thing that's changed is uh, I don't try to go under 20 if possible now. Are you kidding me? I mean, I could die. I have a checkpoint now. We'll do it one more time. We got three one-ups anyways. Seems a little low. <laughs> what do you mean a little low? 88% is very high for hatred. What do you mean? <laughs> you hate it more than 88%? What the hell? I forgot. Dude, I'm just not ready for this today, apparently. I know I can do this, though. It's just a mashing competition and you just win the level. It's not even that bad of a level, it's just turning around on a dime to pick up a cloud is a lot harder than you think it is.
How is there SMB2 mushrooms keep coming this way? How the fuck do I get that? He switch, I guess? Okay. That's not good. Actually, no, that's perfect. Never mind. Holy shit, this is a random boss. Or at least it has a checkpoint, I guess. Oh, I guess you could kill him the old fashioned way, huh? I'm not liking it specifically for the soft walk. Wait, what, 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 why are you sorry about? It's fine, don't worry about it. Make a lot of one ups off of those mice. Oh, not this shit. Oh. At least it gave me indicators. I do appreciate that. How many levels will do that for you? Okay, you know what? I'll take the not explosive death over anything else. I wanted the top, but it won't let me have it. Decent level, but needs some one ups or something. Jeez. Finally a regular level. Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> Unbeknownst to me, there was things waiting for me on the other side. That's on me. I should have done it differently. Oh, you're not supposed to go up there yet. Okay. Oh my god, how did I even make it? make one of off of that. Damn. Wait. Wait, wait. That's a lot of enemies. I can get three one-ups here. This level was kind of awkward. I feel like it's a little blind too. Like 
Like, some spiders is really hard compared to others. That's probably why it's in Super Expert. Is that gonna hit the on off? Oh, I have a time limit, okay. This looks really fucking hard. Do I even need that? I don't even care enough to go get it. Aww, I should have held right. Actually, I could have just dropped and then jumped. This is probably not too bad. If I just shut off the, the contraption early, we'll be fine. Uh oh. Let's just unload it. That's what I wanted to say. It's fine because I don't want it to activate the shell again. You might need to shove for the rest of the level, though. That's the problem with this. Yeah, it looks like you need it. Oh, there's nothing there down there anymore. I was gonna use the bullets. As, okay, I just have to hold right after. Okay, I know exactly how to do this, and this is a terrible level concept. We do that for now. Come back to that. I'm gonna do this just in case I need more. I'm gonna get this. We're gonna kill the things that matter here. Get rid of this, and then... Yeah, we'll, we'll be fine, right? We'll just use the mushroom to go around. Okay, this is just bullshit. <laughs> so if I go too fast, the thwomp will just stop it. It's just a dumb troll that doesn't need to be in the level. Whatever, we can get the other mushroom. Oh my god, dude. How's your junior be like? I could have put that on. Oh my god, I died to too many dumb de reasons in this level. <laughs> Come on.
Well, I got all my max one ups, so I guess we could just do this. I kind of want to see if this is three one-ups or not. Oh, it has one-ups, that's for sure. Okay, um... What did this level change into? I'm supposed to be small? Bruh. I lose my power-ups now. I have no choice. Unless I want to do, like, really stupid things. Alright. What's in here? I'm sorry, but how does this help me? I- I can't even use the power-ups here. I just die. Oh, whatever. We'll just leave Yoshi here. If there is... Okay, it's not a soft lock pit. Good. Spike minute. Oh. I guess we'll put it on then. What a weird level this is. Get out of here, please. Yeah, they do that for every hour, by the way, it does. Just so you know. I had one for like eight hours one day when I was doing so much story in one day. I don't know if it even deserves a boo, it's just... I mean, the thwomp is kind of a troll, to be fair. The level's probably not even that bad if you try to hold right on it. There's not too much spam. The Yoshi and the Firefly make no sense when you just can't do anything with it. So I don't get it. Wait, this level looks familiar. This is a level that has like a really crappy ending or hold on. This could be a different level, but No, this is definitely different than I remember. Oh, there goes the mushroom, I guess. Yeah, this is a nice level, I think. I don't think even the red coins are required either. This is a minute long. I was thinking this is the level that had a really crappy, like... What do they call it? Traditional? Level design, and then there's like a hidden meaning or something behind it, like a hidden block crap fest. This level is just a nice little level. For now. I feel like I already missed a red coin. Am I dead? Not dead. All resets? Okay, I see what you have to do. It's a little scary with the uh, twisters, but sure. Why would I ever pick the regular coin route? 
Oh, because mushroom requirement, I see. I'm just dead now. Even if I reset. Can I even reset? Bro, you're gonna end it off with this? Come on. It's all because I didn't, you know, spin jump off of that one bomb I just lost. Just gonna wait. Oh my god, dude. What, what is this garbage? It's too high up for no reason. It was such a nice level. What happened? Jesus. No, I don't even care about your red coin door now. It's just garbage. Give me another level. I'm done. That's how I felt about that once I realized that section was just building up to that one area. If the bomb in the cloud was one block lower, it would not be an issue. But because the bomb can fall, there's no reset door there or anything. It's just. There should have been a reset door there or something. Make it a, a fun level. Alright, let's start with the level first and then we'll do the wheel spins. I like that you didn't make it re like, you know, required. Kind of nice. Check. Did I fuck up? I actually- I'm pressing down and I can't do anything there. <laughs> I don't like slope stuff like that. It pushes you into a soft walk to death scenario. Oh yeah, you knew about it too. You left it in, you butt. It's just you ground pound early, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you ground pound early. If you don't do that, you don't get the, the required lineup with the wall there. You just, you just, oh my god. Why did you put this in here? I didn't know how this works, so I found out. <laughs> oh, there's not even a checkpoint there. It's so lame. That'd be a good spot to put one, honestly. I 
I just turned around and instantly died. <laughs> this game is so broken. Oh, I fucked up. Never mind, I had to line up still. If I press left there at all, I lose, basically. And that's so weird. There we go. Does it still work? Or do I... Why does it blow up? I don't get it. What did I do wrong? I don't get why it blows up. Maybe it depends on like where the claw is moving, perhaps, with the blow up part. No idea. Oh, because I turned around, huh? Maybe that's what it is. Damn it, because I jumped into it basically. Oh, I see. Maybe I'll just do it on the side that you want me to do it on. That's probably why it's important. I mean, it's kind of cool that you put a triple stack bouncer in the level, I guess. I'm assuming the red pipe is the optional, you, you lose pipe where uh, you didn't kill a single bouncer. Oh, now we get to the generator. Oh, you even put this here just for me, thanks. Look at this. And you, you did it pro wow, okay. Well, we're here now. And the checkpoint! So now we can get an insane amount of points. Look at that. The red pie is reset for Bowser, I see. Dude, this would've been such a nice level to get and super expert. And you know the thing is, it probably is super expert because of the tech, huh? That's what you had to put it in there. I should make this like a beer back screen or something. I guess while we're here, we can do the wheel spins, right? It's just kind of convenient. Let's just, do, let's just do wheel spins, yeah. Damn, so close to still rupees. All right, let's get the other wheel now. Oh, okay, well, I guess we'll go back to the other wheel in here in a second. We have... Regular 5 versus matches on Mario Maker 2.
There, here's the wheel spin for that one. 75,000. Thank you, Siemens. I appreciate it. That's all the wheel spins now. Alright, well... I mean, that made a considerable amount of points and Wait, hold on, we're at a million points already? I wonder if you could have gotten more out of this contraption. I mean, I'm, I'm still thankful regardless for it. Basically, we, we probably could get 5 million per life easily, damn. Anyways, let's just reset here. What do you get at the end over here? You get 95,000 points at the start of that match. That's insane. You know what? It makes up for it. You get three one-ups after checkpoint or second checkpoint. The slope thing is kind of unfortunate. It happens, so that probably will get a few, couple of people like me. If you just don't ground pound at the beginning, you just lose if you turn to the left. The Yoshi tag is like the gate of this level, and it's probably why it's in Super Expert, is my guess. And it has a point inducing system, so it, it does benefit people who want to get max score, I guess. Sure, I don't like the Yoshi tech in it, but that's the only way to make it into Super Expert, so I have to just accept it, sadly. If you want to see this in- if you want to get into Super Expert, Endless One, I mean, so. Also, the Triple Bowser- uh, Triple Stack Bowser is kind of funny. Alright, I think that's it for Mario Maker today.